It's time for you to level up. It's time for you to get out of your routines and start making it a reality and do something unique and different. Struggle a little bit, hurt a little bit, sacrifice and dedicate yourself. Because there's no other way. The time is right now to make a difference, to be better than you was yesterday. Now you may not believe this, but you got to do more than less. You got to give a little bit more than less. Whether it's on your job, with your family, with the workplace, whatever it is that you're doing in the fitness realm, your nutrition, whatever it is that's holding you back, you got to take it to the next level. You got to stop being complacent. You always looking for the easy way out. There is no easy. How can you be successful in life if it's easy? Why do you feel that easy is the best way to get to the level you want? How do you think a champion becomes a champion? A champion doesn't get it the easy way. A champion is a champion for a reason. Now, and I'm not saying you got to get in the ring and knock somebody out, but you definitely got to knock out those excuses. You got to knuckle up and you got to buckle up and you got to be about your business. Why are you constantly, constantly making excuses? Do you really believe that excuses is going to save you? Do you understand what it means that you have to get to a level that you have never been in your life? Do you really have the mental fortitude to level up? This is the time right now for you to recognize the truth about who you really are inside. Now it's true that everybody doesn't have what you have. Everybody doesn't want what you want. But the question is, are you prepared to get what it is that you want? Are you prepared to make the sacrifices? Do you understand what that really means? This is the time for you to wake up and realize that there's something that you need to be doing. But you don't need to be doing excuses. You don't need to be so complacent and lazy about what it is that you are constantly going through in your life and giving your life less than giving your life more. Why do you socialize yourself with excuses? Why do you socialize yourself with misery? Why do you socialize yourself with being complacent? What are you afraid of? Oh, I get it. You're afraid to fail. You're afraid to go back. No one said you had to go back. All you got to do is keep pushing forward. You may fall a few times, you may slip a few times, but that doesn't mean you quit. That doesn't mean you give up. That means you must find a way and you must make a way and you got to continue to dig deeper than you've ever digged in your life. Enough is enough. Enough with the excuses. This is the time to recognize your purpose. This is the time for you to recognize your truth and make the most of your life. And if you're not willing to do that, then nothing's going to happen for you. Nothing is going to give you that true opportunity to be the best of yourself. This is a reality check. Ask yourself, how far have you gone? How much have you given of yourself? Why do you wake up every morning with the same excuse? Why do you wake up every morning saying the same thing over and over again? Why do you feel you need that cup of coffee to start your day? Why do you feel you need to depend on your alarm clock to get up? Well, now all you got to do is just get up. All you got to do is recognize exactly what it is that you need to do in your life. Now this is the time you need to make up. This is the time you need to realize. This is the time you need to do the best that you can and give 110% of everything you got. There are many battles that we all face in life. Certain circumstances will come into your life. And these battles that we must face has different stories connected to it that sometimes we just don't feel that we're prepared for but we must find a way we must find a way in an understanding that this thing that we are dealing with right now in our lives is only temporary it's temporary and it will not last forever you must realize that you must grow enough tenacity within yourself to press on we are all going to face many battles in our lives and some of these battles we will not always win but we must have the winning attitude regardless if we fall down regardless if the struggle is so hard regardless if we get pushed back a few steps we must continue to press on we must disconnect ourselves and stop being pre-
prisoner to the sadness, to the weakness, to the fear, to the doubt. We must become strong. We must become something unique. We must put on that suit of armor and prepare ourselves for battle. Yes, every battle cannot be won. But the winning attitude to not give up is more than enough to carry on. Are you tired? There were times when I just felt that I could not go on. I felt that there was nothing else left for me to give or do. I've given up on myself. I've given up on me. I was at the lowest of the lowest. And I felt that I could not go on. When I felt so weak, I felt there was nothing else left for me to give. But then something happened. Something woke me up. Something made me realize that I had work to do. Nine years ago, to this day, I buried my mother. This amazing, incredible woman told me a long time ago, son, no matter what you do, make a difference in the world. Don't try to change it. But make a difference. But I realize that that doesn't mean just because you don't think you're good enough doesn't mean you can't be good. Doesn't mean you can't be great. Doesn't mean you can't carry on. Every battle that you fight in your life doesn't mean you're going to always win that battle. Because there are going to be many battles that you're going to have to fight. And every battle is not meant for you to win. Sometimes these battles are meant for you to learn. They're meant for you to grow. They're meant for you to understand that you can still keep moving as long as you believe. So yes, you will get tired. Yes, you will question your abilities. Yes, you will start thinking to yourself that, hey, I'm not ready for this. The fact of the matter is, when you were born, you were born and you were ready. When your mind starts to play tricks on you and starts to lie to you and say you're not worthy, you have to understand that you got to take control of your thoughts and your mind and your process and your abilities. Because every test is either meant to be passed or meant to be failed. And you can't be in the business of failing every time you get put in a position where you're being challenged. Can you go on? Absolutely. Can you believe in yourself? You have no choice. But you got to make it happen. You got to believe in it. You got to understand that there's a process to everything. And you got to trust it. And you got to stand on it. You may look at everybody else in the world and look at their success stories, but do you have any idea how they got there? Just keep moving. What's meant for you is for you and no one can take that away from you. Somebody hears your cry. Somebody hears your voice. Somebody is listening to you. You are not alone. You have something. We all have some abilities. You got to go in the direction you want to go. But yes, it's going to challenge you. Yes, you're going to get tired. Yes, you're going to feel, can I do this? Do I have the strength to carry on? You have no choice but to carry on. Don't quit on your life. Don't quit on you. Push your mind and push your body. Find it. Search for it. Go after it. It ain't going to come after you. Find that reason. Find that purpose. One thing about purpose, it's beautiful. And it moves in so many different directions. And why is it existing? Why does it matter at this point? Because it matters to you. 
Sometimes strength is not going to be right there for you. Then you got to go after that strength. You got to go after everything that it is that you are seeking in your life. My beautiful people, understand it. Believe in it. Stand on what you believe in and move forward with a purpose. Make it happen.